Hello everyone. And the first part of the saga about Senua's adventures with Psychosic touched the hearts of many gamers with its story, atmosphere and sound. But it gave rise to many haters for the gameplay component. The second part, unfortunately, won't fix anything. It's still the same walking simulator, beautiful, atmospheric, but walking. This is an ideal game for taking screenshots. By the way, follow my Instagram. You should not have come here, child. The game has become many times better and the largest budget has benefited, but this is not visible in the gameplay. What have you done? Stop! Please help! Anyone help! Help! There's nothing you can do. Do you see the body, Senua? The sea throws them up to show you how you've lost. Look at them, Senua. The faces of the ones you fail. <laughs> Boring puzzles that spoil the atmosphere. What's happening? You know that's in focus. Focus. Don't let it block you. They are suffering. But I set them free. It's there. Focus. You found it. You found it. Focus. It's you there. don't know how deep this darkness goes. Yes, you've done it. You completed the symbol. What now? You must go back to the cage. You must go back. Behind the symbol is the source of the darkness. And the same type of battles with single enemies. Each battle with which repeats the previous one. I don't know what the problem is in making the gameplay more varied. And if you can't, why put in it all? Leave just the walking and torment of the main character. Does the story and atmosphere overcome the boring gameplay? Most likely yes. So if you love story games, I highly recommend playing Boss Hellblade. If gameplay is important to you, it's probably better to pass by. Even the boss fight looks boring and you just have to do the same two hits, dodge, repeat. Slave. 
Subscribe, like, become a sponsor, and thanks for watching. I'll see you soon. Bye.